What's going on guys? Jeremy Hopper here. A couple days ago, I was in my local gun shop and I came across this cartridge box case made by MTM Case Guard. Specifically, this is the model RSLD-50 um, as specified on the lid. If you go to the reverse side on the label, at least where I picked this up at, um, the label specifies RSLD-50-24 and this is designed to hold uh, up to 50 rounds of 500 Smith & Wesson uh, Magnum. But the one thing I notice is the fact that this will hold AA batteries perfectly, just like it was made for it. Zoom in here. You can see how they fit in here. Nice and, uh, well, just like it was made for it, actually. So, I um, thought that was pretty neat. The nice thing about this is that it only costs about three or four bucks, so it's very affordable for the common guy out there uh, to have a good way to store up uh, some batteries in the house and organize them. Um, I like to keep my uh, full cells, um, positive terminal up, partially used cells, positive, terminal down, positive terminals down on these uh, alkaline cells or if I have lithium cells. Once I start getting into, you know, the rechargeable batteries, uh, nickel metal hydrides, whatnot, you know, I uh, kind of do the same format, uh, used cells, positive terminals down. Uh, full cells, positive terminals up, and this also allows me to organize the cells so that I can basically do a first in, uh, first out, kind of like a FIFO type thing. So each cell, um, I'm not favoring more than the next. So every cell gets an equal number of uses uh, because you know rechargeable batteries don't last forever. They have a finite amount of cycles. Um, you know these Sanyueta loops are good for about 1,500 cycles, but uh, it's a lot. But still. Um, you know, I get my money's worth out of this. I ensure that all the batteries get used up uh, in an even fashion here. Just a bit of a rant. But uh, you know what? Uh, this stuff, I like it. And I'm actually starting to uh, organize all, all of my uh, batteries into uh, stuff like this. Uh, so I just want to thank you guys for watching. And I'll catch you in the next video. So long.